Back to the latest update on Ashley TV Philippines. Senator Aquilino Coco Pimentel, the second senator who tested positive for COVID-19, breached the protocols of a hospital in Makati City after accompanying his pregnant wife despite having himself tested. The first senator who acquired COVID-19 was Senate Majority Leader Juan Miguel Zubiri, who announced his positive results last March 16. Pimentel announced that he tested positive for COVID-19 on Wednesday. He disclosed he accompanied his wife Anna Kothrina U. Pimentel at the Makati Medical Hospital last night, March 24, hours before the Research Institute for Tropical Medicine called him and told him that he was positive for the deadly COVID-19. I was informed late last night March 24, 2020 that I have tested positive for the COVID-19 virus. The swab was taken last Friday. March 20, 2020, the senator said in a statement. I have quarantined myself upon the doctor's advice and consistent with the protocol. I feel I am, with God's help, on the way to recovery, he added. Coco's admission raised questions on whether he can be held legally liable for endangering the lives of patients and health workers at the MMC. The MMC later announced on its social accounts that Coco's move to leave the house despite being ill breached its strict infection and containment protocols and rules on home quarantine, according to the national government's guidelines. A number of their nurses and doctors were then exposed and have to be quarantined at a time when the hospital has scarcity in its workforce. The entire delivery room will also have to undergo decontamination and disinfection procedures. We denounce the irresponsible and reckless actions of the senator. He added to the burden of a hospital trying to respond in its competent and aggressive manner to cope with the daunting challenges of this COVID-19 outbreak, the MMC said. And that's the latest news for Ashley TV Philippines.